All right, everybody. First move we're going to show today is the uh, Kimura from Close Guard. For a lot of you, that's going to be on the uh, belt test coming up. So we're going to be swimming underneath to get his hands planted on the ground. Okay. I like to uh, use a thumb uh, for initial control, but when we go for the finish for the Amer or for the Kimura, I'll take my thumb out. Okay. I'm going to open up my legs and pinch with my knees so that he can't move around and hop my guard really quick. I'm going to be putting my armpit on top of his shoulder and reaching around the elbow joint here, okay? I don't have to clasp my hands immediately because on bigger opponents you might not be able to, okay? I just need my hands set up so that when I start to force the angle that I can get the key lock here, okay? So I'm going to start to push the wrist up. As I cut my angle, I can take my thumb out now and get my key lock here for the Kimura. I'm going to rev both my hands forward, tightening up his uh, shoulder joint. Now, some people are you're not going to be big enough in order to close your guard here. If you can close your guard, great. If not, keep everything pinched and tight. Keep the elbow joint right here at a 90 degree and keep it lined up with his shoulders here. So I don't want to bring his elbow down here and I don't want to bring it up high. Okay, I want to think like there's a metal rod running through here and I want to keep it straight. Okay, I want to keep his elbow glued to my chest okay so i don't want to be pushing up here for the finish glued to the chest and then i rotate just the wrist around the corner okay so i'm just rotating it along this axis so if the rod was coming from here and pushing out the elbow joint i'm just spinning it around this point so hands forward and i spin for my finish okay yeah.